so imperious at home, Ross. This has got the makings of a really good game. It really does has the makings to be one of the top matches of the season so far. It's a clash of styles. Rudy Camacho's back at the heart of the back line, joined by Malta Abenson. Darlington Nagby makes it 105 consecutive appearances in MLS, alongside the returning Aiden Morris. Striker Elias Manuel scored here last year, but also missed a penalty. Look out for the blossoming pairing of Emil Forsberg and the fit again, Lewis Morgan is yielding results in their own very identical and identifiable styles. We're underway at lower.com field, live and free around the world on Apple TV. How they've been able to manage Champions, Champions Cup to, to regular season as well, undefeated in five matches. Yabala in behind and with the first chance, and Reyes has come across. They've done a decent job so far. Amundsen, has gone for Yabara again, second time tonight. Reyes stretching the key with him, in the middle for Kucho! <laughs> Unstoppable! Where Columbus could have played this ball in line. Doesn't Amazon put it right into stride of Yaboa, who does so well just to pull it. POI hold this run, and at the last second, he cuts inside, he breaks the line, but he needs somebody middle of the frame, and that's where this man has popped up time and again. Cucho and then as the ball squares him, and for him, that is easy pickings. Top in. That's a little bit of a problem in that last one. A bit more depth on this one, cleared as far as Yaboa. Oh, he thought about the shot. Goes right footed and wide of the target. Will pick. Can't really argue Yaboa, can you? The way he started this game to take it on. Albeit being on his weaker foot. And Edelman absolutely left one in on Morris there and goes into the book. And it'll come back with Peter Straub set up for Morgan. Now Forsberg and instinctively hits it with the outside of the boot and Straub in the keeper. I think it would have been fair enough not to blow the whistle. Players were colliding into one another. Six one way, half a dozen the other. It's enthralling though, isn't it? And that is half time. Andrew Musasi, the referee, blows his whistle. We're underway for the second half. The crew leading by a goal to nil. It's really a little unfortunate not to come away with three points in that one. They're behind right now, and they're watching Herrera feeding Rossi on the right, and he's sizing up Tolkien once more, and he floats into the back for Yaboa's volley, which is over the top. Two unbeaten sides going head-to-head -head here. And two changes on the way for the Red Bulls, who've got Cucho setting up Russell Rowe, scored from distance last week, scores again! on show from champions talk about their quality their build up in transition this is frightening how quickly Adam Morris comes in off the back he pitches the ball good join in it's on the half turn just sets Russell Rowe going forward quick to pick up his head releases it perfect weight on the ball for Russell Rowe to stride on to and that for a confident striker, it's an easy finish. Picks out the corner, puts his ball right through the middle of the ball and puts Columbus Corrupt to a commanding 2 0 lead. Check is complete. It will be the corner. Rossi takes it, takes a flick on near post, turned in by Morris. It's 3 0 Columbus. And it will be three points surely now tonight for the reigning MLS Cup champions. Made the run that led to this corner, Sawatsky making that near post run. It's by design, Rossi is trying to hit that near post. To allow Sawatsky to flick it on, and then Morris completely unmarked. There's an inquest between defenders of whose mark that was, but Morris just needs to make contact. Just needs to provide a platform in his body to redirect the ball into the net. It's as easy as it comes. 
but they've made it that way, Columbus Crew. But the way they play tonight, the intensity. As the jackhammer comes down into the slab of concrete. Behind the goal, you feel it's down. Goes Ferreira, uh, Marrera. And a yellow card for Corey Burke. Zawatski. Cucho instinctively feeds Yaboa, who's got space. Rossi lurking, and that flashed wide. Quite 100% match fit, he's got to get it back. He had surgery in Minnesota by Dr. Chris Larson. That's what Yaboa up against Duncan, and this will be a free kick on the edge of the box. Watching the last 15 minutes, they're making some noise. Cucho hits in, and over the top it goes. Stroud for Emil Forsberg. Looking for Burke at the near post, and he actually got in front. Set things away for Columbus and put clear blue water between these two sides. Two and two for Rossero. This is Forsberg. That's a lovely gliding run, and it's Jenga on his debut. Straight at the keeper. As it tells you about. The kind of battle we've seen really since the off tonight, it might be 3 0. We might know where the points are going, and it's a red card. A second yellow for Edelman means he's off. Often you see him getting things right, his timing right, good at these challenges, but not tonight. Half a step behind. Full time at Lodon Confield. Columbus Crew just keep it rolling. Wilfred Nancy's side.